Good morning children today we will learn about an interesting concept of numbers even and odd numbers you know when we have only one thing we call it single like when we have only one shoe we call it single shoe or when you have one sock you will call it single sock but when we have two shoes we call it a pair of shoes two socks are called pair of socks we always wear shoes and socks in a pair only not single correct hand gloves also come in a pair a pair of earrings mean two earrings you must have seen your mother wearing a pair of earrings the bicycle has a pair of wheels have you seen your mother or your grandmother knitting sweater for you the knitting needles also come in pair birds too have a pair of wings so a pair of slippers a pair of boots a pair of shoelaces a pair of eyes are some more things which come in pairs correct How many wheels are there in a car? Let us see. Two in front and two at back. So, how many wheels are there in a car? Let us see. 1 2 3 4. 1 to make a pair. 3 4 also make a pair. So, we have two pairs of wheels and each set has two wheels remember the tricycle which all the kids love to ride as a baby it has three wheels then how many pairs can we make with them let us see one two three wheels one to make a pair the third one that is the front one is left alone so only one pair of wheels can be formed and one wheel is left alone same way have you seen an auto rickshaw how many wheels it has one in front two at back so it has three wheels how many pairs of wheels can we make at the back the wheels are in a pair here too the front one is left alone now there are five shoes how many pairs can we make with five shoes 1 2 3 4 five shoes 1 2 make a pair 3 4 make a pair o oh, Five is left alone, so we have one pair of shoes, two pair of shoes. So in total, two pair of two two shoes are there, and one shoe is left. There is single shoe remaining. So we can make pairs with two and four, but not with three or five. Correct. You know the numbers which can be matched in pairs are called even numbers so 2 is called an even number how about 4 as we saw we can form two pairs with the four wheels 1 2 and 3 4 so 4 is an even number what do we call the numbers which cannot form pairs well they are called odd numbers so odd numbers cannot be matched in pairs always one will be left alone so maybe that's why they are called odd numbers as one is left alone feeling odd so 3 5 are odd numbers Let us see all the vehicles again. The bicycle has two wheels. That is, it has even number of wheels. 
the tricycle has three wheels so a tricycle has odd number of wheels the auto rickshaw too has three wheels so auto rickshaw has odd number of wheels the car has four wheels so it has even number of wheels just look at this chart with number 1 to 10 see in case of 2 4 6 8 and 10 they are grouped in pairs nothing is left behind so 2 4 6 8 10 are even numbers see the number 1 3 5 7 9 have always one remaining behind after forming pairs see a single is left behind so 1 3 5 Seven, nine are odd numbers. As we saw, all the animals, big or small, had so much fun crossing the river. Right, children? See how cat crossed the river the cat used 1 3 5 7 8 9 numbered stone so the cat used only odd numbered stones correct now let us see the dog crossing the river the dog used 2 4 6 8 and 10 numbered stones so the dog used only the even numbered stones another simple trick that will help you kids to remember that even numbers always end with a digit of 0 2 4 6 or 8 while odd numbers always end with a digit of 1 3 5 7 or 9 later the cat crossed a longer river it used 23 25 27 29 and 31 numbered stones Look at the last digits of all of these numbers. They are three, five, seven, nine, and one. So all of these numbers are odd numbers. Let us take an example. Number twelve. As it ends with a two, it is a even number. See. All the twelve shoes can be paired: one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. No single shoe is remaining. Correct? How about seventeen? There are seventeen socks. As the number seventeen ends with a seven, it is an odd number. See? After forming pairs, one is left alone in the seventeen socks. Understood? Now you know what are even numbers and what are odd numbers. Bye, bye, kids.